Hi viewers, welcome to another very interesting video on LaTeX. Today I will show you how to write matrices and vectors with different type of brackets in LaTeX, including square brackets, parentheses, single vertical line, double vertical line, and finally a generic matrix. And the beauty of this video is that you can change the bracket styles by using a single letter change in the LaTeX code. So let us start. This is a simple LaTeX document structure. Inside begin and end document, we will write the command to write the matrix. First of all, we'll start with this square bracket to start the math mode. And this is the end. Inside these square brackets, you will write the name of the matrix. For example, it is A equal to and then you will start the B matrix environment by using begin B matrix and end B matrix. This is the environment in which you can write matrix of any order. For example, we are going to write a 3 cross 3 matrix. Now we will run this piece of code to see how the generated matrix looks like. So you can see here that this is a 3 cross 3 matrix with square brackets. Now the magic is that you can simply change this word B from here to change the style of the bracket. If I change it from B to P, P for parenthesis, in both the begin and end statements, the same matrix will be written in the parenthesis. So you see here, the same matrix is now written in the parenthesis. If you want to write the matrix by using single vertical line as we use it in writing determinants, then you simply replace this P with V, V for vertical line. So it will generate the same matrix with vertical line. And finally, if you want to write the matrix in double vertical line, simply replace this lowercase V with uppercase V like this in both these statements, you can see that the generated matrix is now written inside double vertical lines. Or you are going to write an n cross n matrix, then you need to use vertical and horizontal dots to show the continuation of the elements. How can we do this? Let us see. So this is the general formulation of a matrix. I am going to write it inside B matrix environment. So this is the first element a11, then a12, and then this command, which is backslash dots, it is used to write horizontal dots to show the continuation inside a row. If you move inside a column, then you need to use backslash v dots, v for vertical. So it will place vertical dots to show continuation in a column. And if you want to show the continuation in the diagonal, then you need to use this backslash d dots. So now if I run this code, you can see that this is a generic matrix containing all three types of continuation. So I hope you understand how to write matrices in LaTeX in a very simple and interesting way. Thank you for watching this video. Stay tuned to our channel, Electrical Lectures.